Oh boy, today I have this hot honey fried chicken biscuit recipe. Are y'all ready? Hi everyone, welcome and welcome back to my channel. Are you looking for something to spice your brunch, your Easter brunch? Well, today I'm making this hot honey fried chicken biscuit. Stay tuned. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Also, if you're new to my channel, please subscribe and let's jump right into the recipe. Before we begin, all of the ingredients for today's recipe will be listed below for you. I am using four boneless, skinless chicken thighs. I'm going to trim as much fat as I can, and then we shall season this chicken. Once you're done trimming all of the fat, of course there might be some left, that's okay. I am going to transfer the chicken to a bowl, then we're going to season. I'm using a lot of seasoning for today's recipe, y'all. I'm using Cajun seasoning, Sazon, also some lemon pepper for a nice zesty flavor going to pour that in and also I am going to be adding some hot sauce and I know I get a lot of questions you guys always ask is it going to be spicy no it's just going to give it a nice distinct in a good way flavor okay also you can't forget that pickle juice honey you're gonna have that nice buttermilk with the hints of the vinegar in there it's going to be so good okay so I'm going to give that a mix just like so. Then we are going to add, guess what? Yes, yes, you guessed it, some buttermilk. This is going to make the chicken so juicy and so tender. Oh yeah, you just, just wait on it. Just trust the process, okay? Give that another stir, cover it, place it in the fridge for about 20 minutes or longer if you have time. And we're going to move on to the flour. For the flour, you are going to be adding one tablespoon of cornstarch. Mm -hmm. Gotta add that cornstarch for that crunchiness. And also these are the seasoning. I'm using onion powder, garlic powder, paprika, ground black pepper, parsley, Cajun season, Creole season, as well as some celery salt. Yes. Give that a quick mix. Make sure everything is well combined. Okay. And then you are going to dredge your chicken in there okay by now my 20 minutes is up my chicken is nice and done soaked all of that goodness from that buttermilk seasoning bath whatever you want to call it now I'm going to grab the chicken allow the excess buttermilk to drip and then I am going to place it in the seasoned flour I am going to put it back in the buttermilk because I want a thicker breading on the chicken so Now, if your chicken don't look like this, please do it again. I'm kidding y'all. <laughs> but after you coated the chicken with the flour twice, this is 
what you should have, okay? Now I'm going to set that aside and moving on to the biscuit. It's just better to coat all the chicken with the flour ahead of time. Now this is the biscuit I'll be using, um, Southern style, okay? Home style Southern, I don't even know. At this point, I had a mini heart attack because I was halfway through opening this can and it popped open. It popped. I hate opening these, okay? Just, I hate them. But anyways, they come with eight, but I'm using six only because I have four chicken. The two is for me. Mind your business, okay? <laughs> I'm going to bake it following the direction on the can. While that is baking, I am going to fry the chicken. I have my oil heating on 350. 50 degrees I am going to gently place the chicken in there I'm going to cook two chicken at a time by the way and I'm going to cook the chicken for about six to seven minutes per side once one side is nice and golden brown I am going to flip it over allow the other side to fry Now y'all see how good this chicken looks, right? Okay, I was just making sure. Now the chicken is nice and crunchy and crispy, nice and ready to go. I am going to remove it, place it on a cooling rack or some napkins just to soak all of that oil off. And then we are going to make our hot honey sauce. The hot honey sauce is extremely easy to make. You can even make it in a microwave. But for today's recipe, we're using a stove. That's how easy it is, okay? Okay, I have my skillet getting nice and hot. I am going to place four tablespoons of unsalted butter in there. Once that is melted, I am coming in with the honey. And also, I'll be adding some hot sauce in there as well. Once your sauce started to look like this, nice and thick, it is done, okay? So now it's time for you to grab your biscuit in the oven and let's get this going, right? So I am going to slice the biscuit right in the middle. Sorry, it's missing one already. <laughs> I'm going to slice it right in the middle. I'm going to place the chicken right on there. Now I'm going to pour the hot honey sauce on there and place the other bun. I went ahead and add some dry parsley just to garnish, but this looks so good, you guys. And taste, oh my God, this chicken was so flavorful. This recipe needs to be on your Easter brunch or breakfast, okay? It's 10 out of 10, definitely would recommend, okay? It's so, so, so good. Try it out, let me know what you think. If you enjoyed today's recipe, give it a thumbs up. And yeah, subscribe if you're new. I'll see you beautiful people on the next one. Bye guys.